So looking forward to see you at inspection. As a as a real estate consultant, also your agent, when I represent a buyer and purchasing property, inspection is probably one of the most imp important part of the sale of the home. The when you put an offer into this property, basically the words speak clearly that you buy the property as is, but then you have the right to hire an inspector or several inspector for that matter to look at the condition of the property. As a real estate agent, I am doing a, an inspection as well, but you just basically, based on my, what I can see, it's called visual inspection. But in this case, a professional who's expert in looking at the general condition of the home will look at, look at the whole house. This inspector will come in, he will climb on top of the roof, he will go under if there's a basement, and he will look everything in between from the front to the back and provide a copy of report for us. Generally, the report will entail things that you need to know about the property, what other condition. What I advise my client would be like this. When you come to the inspection, please be sure to be there at least half hour before the inspection ends. You don't have to be there for the whole entire time, but please be there no later than half an hour. And it's important that I'm sure when you're at a house, you see many, many things. you got all kinds of questions as an inspector. The inspector that I normally work with are very experienced. They have done hundreds, some thousands of homes. They know just about everything and answer, can answer the question very well. But for you as a buyer, you have all kinds of questions. It's important that you do not interrupt their work. Do your best to, if, if you have any questions, take a notepad with you, write them all down, so that at the end of the inspection, we discuss it with the inspector. You know, I've seen some buyer who are so excited and keep interrupting the inspector. The inspector might be looking at the roof, and then you ask a question about the plumbing, when he may be looking at the toilet, and then you might be asking something else about electrical. And I don't believe the inspector can do the best job for you when you when he's, he's interrupted by the buyer. So write out all the questions. At the end of the inspection, we'll sit down together, discuss all the issue. We'll try to get them to give us a report at the end of the inspection, but just sometimes it's not always possible. And I try to position you very well. The inspector will spend the maximum amount of time on you, on the house, and also answer address any question for you. The inspector that I work with, I require that they will be there to answer any question for you at any time, even way after escrow close, even years afterward. And uh, normally the inspector I, I work with are able to, to, to be there for you. They'll provide their cell phone number for you. So those are added assurance for you. Buying a home is very expensive. I want to make sure that whatever you get, you get the best, the professional, whether it be the inspector, hopefully the loan person you work with, and host uh, every kind of area as well. And I hope that helps you a lot. Look forward to see you, and if you have any questions, feel free to let me know. Thank you.